Sometimes I don't know the reason why So I guess I'll keep gambling lots of moves And lots of rambling Well it's easier than just a waiting around to die PJ! will do. gonna hurt you. We've got your boy, he's safe. If you want to see him again, you'll drop that knife. Now. I'm not fucking around. Let's make a deal. You lower yours, I'll lower mine. I'll count of three. One, two, three. Good here. Look, if we 
wanted to hurt you, we would have by now. Considering the circumstances, I'll let this little standoff slide. But you only get one strike. Now, are you gonna behave so I can take you to see your boy? Because if you really want to fight, you're a little outnumbered. Truth. Now please, just take me to see him. All right, since you asked so nicely. Sorry about locking the door and tying you to the bed and all. You were in uh, pretty rough shape when we found you. You had to take precautions, you know, just in case. But you're safe now, and so is your friend. I'm Marlin, that's Tennessee, but uh, call him Ten for short. He's one bit taking care of you. He uh, doesn't talk much. Clementine. Come on, let's go see your boy. You've been surviving out there a while, huh? Yeah, we've been on the road a long time. Take it you know how to handle yourself? I usually see people our age alone out in the wild. Sure, I do what I can to get by. No matter what. Hey, don't worry about it. We all do what we have to. It's good we found you when we did. It wasn't easy getting you two out of that wreck. The walkers were on the way. The car, was it totaled? Yeah. Fuck. Had to work fast. I don't know what would have happened if we hadn't seen the smoke. I appreciate it. All alone with the kid? Not a pleasant thought. I've seen some rough scenes. But that one up there. Hey, you want to lose some more teeth? Keep staring. Was that really necessary? What's his problem? You're just new. I mean, we haven't seen anything like you in... ever. What is this place? You can probably tell it used to be a school. Now it's whatever we want it to be. And who's in charge? Uh, well, I am. Probably sounds strange, kids run by a kid, but we do all right for ourselves. We've got good walls, good defenses, and a good location too. No one really comes out this way anymore. We've carved ourselves the perfect camp. Kids are safe here. We make sure of it. No adults. At all. It wasn't always like this though. People leave, they die. There's less of us all around. I got us a system in place that works well enough. Allow me to make it formal. Welcome to Erickson's boarding school for troubled youth. You and your boy feels like you both fit that description. I'm just speculating, seeing how you threaten Willie. And then again, it's hard to survive too long these days without being a bit troubled. You got me and AJ all wrong, Marlin. A couple of pure angels. <laughs> Jury's still out on you. But an angel your boy is decidedly not. It's been a little terror since he arrived. Excuse me? Let's just say he hasn't been happy without you around. At all. Yo! Marlin! We got walkers on the fence! Shit. I need to take care of this. Knowing Willie, it's probably two grandma walkers and an angry squirrel. You got bigger fish. The kid's inside. I think he's with Lewis. Lewis? Oh, right. Uh, just listen for the music. You'll find him. Get a move on, Willie! Where's your damn weapon?
Follow the music. Check. Mm, nope. Music sounds like it's coming from this floor. Good kid. You must have provoked him. Tapping him on the shoulder ain't provoking. This is what I get for trying to be nice to the kid? Well, screw you both. Listen to me. That girl out there says you bit her. Is that true? I'm sure she didn't mean to scare you. I'm sorry, AJ. She snuck up on me. I didn't want to hurt her. I know you didn't, but no more bites, okay? No more bites. You're not dead. That's good. Watch the kid for you. My name is AJ. Excuse me. Hope he didn't cause you any trouble. He was a bit of a handful. But I got off light compared to what Ruby went through. AJ doesn't like people coming up behind him. Don't ever do it. Loud and clear, little man. Thankfully, I was here to calm him down with my alluring music. I'm Lewis. Clementine. Oh, yeah. Totally forgot. Marlon left your bag in here somewhere. Don't worry, I've got it. Double, um, does he know what that is? It's dirty. Clean it. Maybe later. Back you go. Where it belongs. Dude, that can't be a good idea. That thing's bigger than him. Is it actually loaded? Yes. Oh, good. I'll guarantee he's a better shot than you. Hey. You guys do your thing, I guess. You don't know any others? Well, there is one. But you're armed. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling Clementine. You are lost and gone forever. Ah, I love that song. Dreadful sorry, Clementine. Light she was, and like a fairy, and her shoes were number nine. Herring boxes without topses, sandals were for Clementine. <laughs> what do you think, AJ? I don't know. It's loud. It is. Loud is bad. 
Not always. Come press this key. Come on. This one right here. Go ahead, AJ. Press it. Now press this one. And this one. <laughs> You're a natural. Hey! Have you seen Rosie? Nope. Shit. We've got a bit of a situation out there. Um, <clears throat> to ask you just coming to and all, but could really use a hand. You up for taking out a few deadheads? You too, Lewis. Get your ass in gear. <sighs> Fine. Rosie! Where the hell is she? You give her her weapon back? Good. We're gonna need you to put it to use. We've got a hunting party out there trying to get back inside. Need our help to clear the way. Seems to be a few more than usual these last couple days. It's almost like something drew their attention. Something like, I don't know, an explosion or a car crash. Bye. What? Just saying. There's got to be some explanation. Look, I didn't know any of that was going to happen. Sorry if it caused you guys problems. Uh, um. Hello, Clementine. I'm Violet. Nice to meet you. What he said. All right, boys and girls. They're starting to fill in. Come on. Be careful out there. Don't mind Violet. She, uh, grows on you. I promise. Oh, this? It's a chair leg. I call it Cheryl's. Clay, let me help! I need you to watch my back. Call out from inside if you see anything. Cool? Okay. See you on the other side.
We're not going to be able to hold them off much longer. No kidding. Where'd all these walkers come from? We can talk when we're back inside the gates. Keep an eye out for stragglers. You know, you're not half bad, considering the circumstances and all. Thanks. Let's finish these guys off. We don't need them attracting more walkers back to the school. It's all right, girl. It's all right. Hey, see you and Rosie are making friends. Had a bad experience with the dog wines. Well, Rosie here can help you get over it. She's as cuddly as they come. Oh, except when she's mauling walkers, that is. <sighs> that walker came out of nowhere. All right, all right. Fun's over. Let's get inside. Ah, fucking starving. You're not the only one. How'd it go out there? How do you think it went? Be nice, Asim. The safe stone's nearly dry, and I could barely find enough for tonight. We're gonna have to scout out further if we want food for the winter. We'll talk about it later. Bullshit. We should talk about this right now. I said later, damn it. Still standing, I see. I'd call that a B-plus performance there, Vi. You've done better. Fuck off. B minus then. Now, Clem here. That was a solid A. A plus even. Don't be jealous, Vi. Be better. Yep, I'm pretty much a badass. And she's modest. Do the wonders never cease? I wish your mouth would cease. We kicked 19 kinds of walker ass. And with style. Why not be proud? <laughs> 